Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Nicholas Earl, and welcome back to another episode of Earl Sports Bets. And today we have another free pick video. This in the NFL for Monday Night Football when the Miami Dolphins travel to New Orleans to take on the Saints. Hey, guys, EarlSportsBets.com has finally launched. And to show our appreciation for you, click on the link below or go to EarlSportsBets.com backslash promo to get the seven-day package for only $49. That's $120 in savings. Thanks, guys. And in this matchup here with the Miami Dolphins, as actually three-point favorites now in this game on the road in New Orleans, total around 37. And this line has moved. This start, this line opened up at Saints minus three, and it's since moved to Miami minus three. Uh, when they announced that Tyreek Hill, or not Tyreek Hill, Taysom Hill is going to be out for this game. Uh, so they're going to be down to Ian Book making his NFL debut. Looking at the Miami Dolphins here, or looking at these two teams, 7-7 seven and seven Miami uh, with 7-6-1 seven, and one against the spread. They're 6-8 and eight over under. They're 2-3 and three on the road this year. We have New Orleans who are 7-7 seven and seven this year. They're 7-7 seven and seven against the spread. They're 6-8 and eight over under, and they're 1-4 and four at home. Miami coming in off a 24-20, uh, 20-30, Wow, thirty-one to twenty-four win over the New York Jets as ten and a half point favorites. They did, or they did not cover the spread. There, they covered the spread in their previous five games versus the Giants, Panthers, Jets, Ravens, and Texans. And on the other side, we have the New Orleans Saints coming in, covering in back-to-back games. They've looked a little bit better as of late, beating the Tampa Bay Buccaneers nine nothing last week. Low-scoring game there, obviously. Their defenses looked really good. And 30 to 9 the previous week against the New York Jets. They've actually gone under the total in four straight games. Both these teams have trended towards the under as of late. Uh, but we're not going to be looking at a total in this game. I personally think this line's moved too much. And I think the value is on the Saints here, getting plus three. Uh, this is still a, a, if we look at what the Miami Dolphins have done this year, they haven't really proved too much to me here. Yeah, they started off one and seven. Now they're seven and seven. But look at what they've done. Uh, since they started off one and seven, they beat the Houston Texans. They beat the Baltimore Ravens. That was a good win. That was their good win. Jets, Panthers, Giants, and Jets. Not really high quality wins here. And I think the New Orleans Saints are definitely a step up in competition uh, from the, the Jets and the Giants and the Panthers and the Texans. I think this is going to be a huge step up in competition. Yeah, they're in the New uh, they're in the Superdome. So I think this is a game the Saints win. Even with Ian Book at quarterback, I think he's going to be better than people expect. So I'm going to go with the New Orleans Saints here, plus the three points. I expect this to be a low-scoring game, so I think this could be potentially like a 16-14 type of game. So give me the Saints, plus the three points here on Monday Night Football against the Miami Dolphins. If this information was helpful to you guys at all, feel free to hit that thumbs-up button and subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already, and turn on those post notifications so you guys are notified each and every time we come out with a video here at Earl Sports Bets, or we go live, which is every single morning, 10 or 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Earl Sports Bets Show. That's going to just about wrap it up for this one. I want to thank you guys as always for watching and 